Hello, Rathanikans. Welcome back to our YouTube channel. And we are back again with the job vacancy, and it is a government job. Yes, it is a government job, Union Public Service Commission, that is UPSC. They are teaching chemistry and pharmacology candidates for the post of toxicology scientists. And the salary which you will be getting is up to rupees 1.77 lakh, right? So it's a great opportunity to work with the Union Public Service Commission for the chemistry and the pharmacology candidates. So let's see what are the job responsibilities or the eligibility criteria and how to apply for this particular job posting and what is the last date to apply for this particular job by UPS. So the vacancy number for this job is 2203050321. Okay, so this is very much important when you're applying online for this job. So you have you can you know make a note of this number. That's the vacancy number for the job. The job title, as I said, is they are hiring scientist for the toxicology department. Okay, that's the toxicology scientist. Okay, now that's a job title. The classification, so the ministry administrative administration and the ministry of home affairs they will be uh, taking charge of this particular uh, whole job by upsc the department and offices so the directorate of forensic science and services are the head of this particular department okay the organization is the central forensic science laboratory and the number of posts which is weakened is one the pay scale now the most important part the pay scale or the pay level so the pay level is 10 and the pay scale lies between 56000 to 1.77 lakh okay so the pay matrix lies under the rules of 2016 ccs rp okay and the total emolu emoluments excluding the ta and hra at the time of the initial appointment will be rupees 56100 plus DA as applicable for it. Okay, so this is excluding the TA and the HRA. Okay, now the age limit. So the candidate should not exceed 35 years of age as a normal closing date of this particular job notification by UPSC. Okay, now comes on to the eligibility criteria. So the candidates who have a master degree in chemistry, or AIC examination or pharmacology or pharma pharmacy. Okay, so the candidates who have a master degree in chemistry, pharmacology, and pharmacy can apply for this particular job vacancy. Apart from that, the candidates who have bachelor degree in chemistry can also apply for this particular job vacancy. So they should have a bachelor degree from a recognized university or an institute. Okay. So that was the eligibility criteria about this particular job we can see by Union Public Service Commission. Okay. Now, the experience which is required is only three years of experience is required of analytical methods and research in the field of toxicology in central government or in state government organization. Okay. So you should have three years of experience in the central government or the state government in the field of toxicology, okay? Now, the desirable qualification is the experience of working in a forensic science laboratory would be a plus point for you if you are applying for this particular job, okay? The duties, now comes on to the duties. If you are selected for this particular job, we can see, so the roles, responsibilities, the duties which you will be given is a crime scene management, crime case management, you know, Besto expert testimony and the factor in the courts, courts of law and subject matter and the provision of CRPC and Indian Evidence Act. Okay, so these are the duties which you will be given if you are selected for this particular job vacancy. The probation period is of one year and you will be recruited for the headquarters at New Delhi with laboratories at Kolkata, Chandigarh, Hyderabad, Bhopal. Assam and Pune. Okay, so these are the uh, laboratories where you can be, uh, you know, working and with the headquarters will be at New Delhi. Okay, so 
that was all about this particular job we can see so once again the candidates who have master's degree in chemistry bachelor's degree in chemistry can apply for this particular job and apart from the chemistry candidates the candidates who have a master's degree in pharmacy and pharmacology can also apply for this particular job we can see right so the last date to apply for this particular job is 31st of march 2022 that's the last date to apply for this job now the most important thing how to apply for this job okay so you know that well what you have to do is you have to go to www.rasaynika.com and then log on to this uh land on to this page that is upsc chemistry pharmacology scientist vacancy okay and you can find out the link of this particular page in the description box below okay so once you are there on the page you just have to scroll it down and just above the editor notes so this is the editor's notes so click here to apply online option is there okay you just have to click on it and the main notification from the official website of upsc will open up and you have to search the vacancy number okay so this was our vacancy number this one So that is two two zero three zero five zero three two one two. So you have to search the vacancy number over here, which is this one, and then you have to apply for this particular job right here. Okay, so you can click on apply now directly, and then apply for this particular job by UPS. Okay, so that was it all about in today's video. So if you feel this video is helpful for you, you can go ahead and share it as much as you can with your friends and colleagues, and. Don't forget to like and subscribe to our YouTube channel, and you can also subscribe to our Rasaynika Telegram channel, where you can get hourly updates on the chemistry and pharma job vacancy in the government and private sector. So thank you so much, guys. We'll see you in our next video. Till then, stay safe. Stay safe.